Okay, hi guys. Hi. Hello and welcome. Welcome back to my channel. I don't know if you guys have been watching my snap story, but this is my sister, Ashley. Hello. My roommate, if you will. By the way, if anyone was wondering about like this quality of this video or anything, I'm filming this on my iPhone. So it's good quality. It's the best quality, <laughs> actually. And we're in the car, and my arm. I'm just holding this with my arm because... So if it's shaky as fuck, don't say anything. So, <laughs> please just don't say anything about that in the comments. I never, like, understand why everyone always says that. What? Says hello welcome? and welcome. Like, well, hello, will, YouTube not, will YouTube not publish that if they don't? No. They, it, it's not published uh, unless yeah, they agree to. It's a fact. If you don't say welcome, they uh, actually take down your video. Yeah. Got it. Got it. Be careful with the people who run YouTube analytics. True. Or like whatever. It's all about them, not about us. No, it's true. They're very They're here to make money, not watch your damn video. Should we start with like the same questions? Mm-mm. Just keep going with questions. If you don't have them on Snap and you roll across this, you just miss it. Oh, this one says here. you single question mark like a little little winky face. I am. I'm single. Be honest. I'm single right now. I promise. I promise I'm single right now. Single or like Slightly taken. Like fully single. Oh wow. Oh, I'm, I'm not, no. Ashley's taken. I'm, yes. Next question. Next question. It says, when am I gonna see you again? That's Today gonna... in this video. Oh Welcome. my god, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Next question. Fave candy bar. Do you do you know my fave candy bar? Snickers. <laughs> No, mine's Reese's. Reese's, I forgot about that. Reese's, you know I love I peanut know. butter. I, I love peanut butter. I just... Okay, this is three questions. First one, favorite childhood memory? Together or apart? I, a, a, a part, a part, a part. Oh. Wow, I don't know how to speak. Okay, apart. Okay, hang on. Just like your your own, your like for yourself. Let me think. Favorite childhood memory? I don't know. I don't know either. Wow, this one's Should hard. Should we just Next. skip this one? <laughs> I don't know. We're skipping it. No, no. Oh, this one's a good one. It says, how did you come out to your sister? My sister was the first person I came out to. I, you knew that, right? Mm -hmm. And it was actually like this. Like, we were in the car. Do you remember this? Were we? Yes. We were in the car on we're the way home from, from a party. party. I remember. Yeah. We were literally about to turn and drive. We were like, I have to tell you something. I was like, yeah, sure. Like, what? And then just, bah. I was crying. I was you, crying. Yeah, we parked and she cried. Like, yeah. we were literally, like, sitting outside we of our outside house. We were outside the house. And you were just like crying, and I like we hugged. Yeah. In the car, we were like sitting in our seats, like we were like hugged. But that's, I cried. That, yeah, <laughs> that's kind of the story, though. Yeah. It was good. It was a wow, good. Wow, I totally forgot about that, but we definitely were on our way home from the party. Next question. Ooh, this one says, "What's your biggest scandal?" I can't answer this because it's too hot. <laughs> oh my god, what's my biggest scandal? I don't know. Honestly, leading too many men on at once. That's probably not my biggest, but just like kind of an everyday That's just handle. kind of like- um, This one, what's your favorite Ariana Grande song? <laughs> Mine probably right now is definitely like Seven Rings because okay, it just came out. It's just like really different from what like she's done in like her music. Like I feel like all of her songs early on were all just like the same. I just don't really remember her doing anything outside of having a high ponytail and acting in this one says, what's your skincare routine? Um, I kind of feel called out right now on this question because my skin is not looking good. Morning routine or skincare night routine? I think just the whole thing. In the morning, I shower and I use you the- wash your face in the shower? Yeah, I wash my face in the shower. And I use the Laneige um, body, or body wash what? Face, face wash. wash. I'm sorry, I don't know how to speak. Like, it's like the one in like the teal bottle. I use that in the morning. It's really good face wash. It's like mattifying and it's cause like I have like oilier skin. So it's really nice for my skin, I think. And then I get out and I use moisturizer. And I usually use the Clinique for men moisturizer. I really like that for the morning. Because then like it doesn't make my skin look like very greasy or anything during the day. Like, I wash oh. my face at night. And I just use like uh just like a really light like Cetaphil um cleanser, cleanser for yep. my face. For and you. then thank you. And then I use um a Neutrogena moisturizer for my face afterwards because it's like thicker and I yeah. feel like it like moisturizes better at night. At night. That's good. That's that was great. a good one. Good one. Oh it says what's the tea on nursing school sis? Let me tell you about it. Oh my god it sucks but I love it at the I same time. It. It's like so, it's the like weirdest like love hate relationship I've ever had in my whole entire life. Like school sucks because I Person, like I go through the university center 
And so I only go three days a week right now because clinicals haven't started. And once clinicals start, I go Mondays and Fridays for clinicals. So I only have class right now, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. But I have class from like eight to three every day. And like every single day we come to class and we're supposed to have read like 50 pages for each class. And we have like two or three classes a day. So that's 150 pages. So 150 pages, simple maths. And it's like, oh, it's just so much work and lot. like, it's a lot, but also like I really enjoy what we're learning. I've never had that really in school where like I was like genuinely enjoy. It, helps, it motivates you more. Right? Yeah. To, like, to like what you're doing. Yes. Like literally like I'll be like studying and reading and stuff and like I don't even look at the clock. Like I'm just like actually like what we're learning and stuff. Also like stuff you can use. Yeah. And like it's stuff, yeah, that you can use that's like helpful to people. That, like, <laughs> I can see, like, oh, my God, in the future, like, this is going to be me as a nurse. Like, yes. yeah, so I really like that. And, like, I don't know. So there's just, like, give and take to all of it. Yeah. That's that's the tea, sis. That's what's going on. <laughs> this one says, how the fuck do you cover a hickey? Tip, cold spoon, put it, always keep a spoon in the freezer. Yes. In case you, because you should put the cold spoon on it. That'll help make it. Tremendously. I don't know, whatever less red. It seriously will, honestly. Um, like, wear a turtleneck or a scarf if yeah. it's really fucking bad. Yeah. That's what I would do. True. Um, oh. Also, concealer and foundation is your only next like, option. Like, ways to cover. Yes. Um, for me, my freshman year, I literally just wanted them. I didn't care. I was like, okay, are you going to say something? Yes. I would say if you're at your job, maybe not a Oh, true, I guess. If you're at anywhere else, maybe not grandma's house, but like... Or maybe not your parents' house, yeah. but anywhere else. But like, if you're at college, who cares? in your dorm, I don't think anybody's gonna Or like care. class, like, yeah. who cares? Um, yeah, but seriously, keep, like, I always kept two spoons in my freezer. So that and, you can use one and then like, have a backup. Because like, they, like get warm pretty fast and then I would just put another one on and seriously it like makes it go away way quicker than what you would think yes yeah so that's definitely the best pro tip also just ask them to do it not in a visible place like, true like that will save you millions this one says at what point did you realize you were gay I'm gonna censor it and say you were gay because it says you like meek <laughs> I don't know, I kind of like always had like the inkling. When I really like realized it was dead serious. I don't know if I've told you the story, but when I watched I the movie, The Hot Chick, which is like an ugly, like kind of like a bootleg movie. Sorry if like it's your favorite movie or anything, but like, um, it has like Rob Schneider in it. Um, I don't know, but it's about like this girl and she like switches lives with Rob Schneider. He, is he the one with the, like, curly hair? Yeah. Okay. From, like, the 80s or the 90s, whatever. Anything. Um, and he, like, switches places. But the girl who switches places with him dates this guy. His name's Matthew Lawrence. And he was, like, the first guy I ever was, like, whoa. Wow, he's cute. Yeah. And, like, from seeing that, I was, like, I'm gay. I know it now. I know for sure. Oh, this says, what music do you want played at your funeral? What a, like, <laughs> what a sad question. What a morbid question. What about, let's talk about some music we want played at a more exciting event. Like, our wedding! Our wedding! So are we modifying <laughs> this question? I mean, do you have an answer? That's so sad. Honestly, probably. There could be so much more music out for the So days. true. So true. Maybe, yeah, I can't answer that because, yeah, I don't know the music that's going to be out there. I don't know what wavelengths we're going to be on then. At my wedding, though, I want, like, fun music. Like, I'm a, I like to dance. What is your ideal, like, first dance song? Ooh. Or do you not want to expose it? I have, like, a few. Right? Like, seven. Like, seven first dances. Because <laughs> I love all the songs. But, like, but, like I... Are they ever going to be done dancing? No. 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 And if you step You're on the dance floor, wedding. get the fuck out of our <laughs> wedding. Like, no, you can't. I'm still <laughs> dancing. Like, this is the first dance. Like, it's been a half hour. Yeah. It has been. It's a long dance. <laughs> Do you think you'll do a synchronized dance? What does that mean? Like you would like synchronized wedding? swimming? Kind of. No. Like 
we have to wear those ugly like Cats. nose pieces. <laughs> like, that's like, hair, like, <laughs> like swim swim caps. Yeah. No, like you and your wedding party like learn a dance and do it. No. Some of the songs though for that, like <laughs> I know this sounds stupid, but I really like the song like Beautiful by Bazzi with like Camila Co oh, Camila oh. Cobeo. You know? It's like beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Oh yeah. Okay. I really like that one. That's um pretty. There's a song, it's by Jay-Z and Beyonce, it's called... You would have that at your wedding. Yeah, I would. I so would. Um, hold on, I'm trying to think of what it's called. Oh, On The Run, part two. It's like, it's kind of like a like a bop song, but it's like slow. It's like, just like, okay. kind of like a slow two-step. I so really, like really like it. Yeah, I was like, this could honestly work. Like, I really like that. Um, oh, the song, like, Perfect featuring Beyonce. Oh, yeah. I really like that one. That's also a good one. Mm -hmm. What are some of yours? I, know, I strictly only like like slow country songs. Oh, you know what I mean? Like the typical like okay. wedding song. Yeah, I like I that. I really love, um, what's the one by Shania Twain? Forever From and this Always. Moment, oh. From This Moment On. That was oh, beautiful. I love, love that. that. Love that. Love a like Best friend Tim McGraw, it's your love Tim McGraw. Oh, you know what okay. I mean? Um, yeah. Whether in the, you know what I mean? Just like amazed. Like yeah. that song, like Baby I'm Amazed by You. Just like oh, classic yeah. songs. Just like classic old country love songs. Love songs just melt my wow. heart. Wow. Wow. Love that. Ooh, how long does it take each of us to get ready in the morning? Uh, do you want me to answer first? Sure. For me, it takes at least, okay, to get ready, at least 30 minutes. Because I have to shower, which takes like 15 minutes. And I get out of the shower, like put on moisturizer, clean my ears, um, blow dry my hair. Yeah, and like put stuff in my hair. And that, and like that's just like me like getting ready. Oh, and then like I have to go upstairs, I guess, and put on clothes, yes. which literally is like maybe three minutes, like really quick. Like I just like yeah. put on clothes like that. But then, like, when I come downstairs, then I have to eat breakfast in the morning. So, like, mm -hmm. if we include breakfast, it's, like, a solid yeah. hour. Yeah. I don't include breakfast in mine. Okay. Because I don't eat breakfast. Like, when I get ready, I eat at work. Because I don't have no time. Oh. Uh, well, at least you can eat it at work. Yeah. Um, how long for you? I would say, ideally, I would start getting ready maybe, like, 6.20. And I would be ready to leave the house by like seven thirty, so maybe like an hour and ten minutes. Okay, yeah. -ish. Wow, we're the same. Yeah. I wow. mean, yeah. Sometimes I'm like, I don't know. I feel like I d I don't hardly do shit though. Like, I literally I don't shower in the morning. Shower at night. Okay. I don't oh, yeah. do my hair. True. So like that's not taking any time. I literally just like get up, wash my face, do my makeup, that's the majority of the time. And then getting dressed also takes me a shit ton of time because I'm like, what should I wear today? So like, I feel like I do hardly anything, but it takes me forever. Next one, would you rather be a famous singer or a famous movie star? Probably a movie star. Okay. Because I would rather watch myself on film than listen to my songs in the car. I don't know, like I think it'd be really cool to be a famous singer. But, like, I'm really into music, and, like, I love, like, following artists and, like, their concerts and, like, whatever. Yeah. And I've realized, like, to be a famous singer, it's, like, way more work than, like, a movie star. Which, like, not saying, like, oh, my God, like, I would I hate it because, like, <laughs> no. there's so much work involved. Like, I would not. Yeah. But, like... But, like, if you have to go on tour... Yeah, like, a tour lasts months, and, like, you're constantly traveling, constantly... Yeah, and in shitty conditions. Yes. And, like... like and like that's like kind of like your life like you're constantly on the move on the move traveling you know like you can never yeah. just like take a breath like you know because no, then people are like forget about you and move on to the next artist yes yeah and well then like a movie star the pro like you do like a big movie you know like you get your 15 minutes or whatever but then like it's not consistent where like i feel like singing is like way more consistent in like yeah. being famous and stuff so like you always have to keep coming out with stuff to stay relevant. Yes, exactly. Yes. Or like 
for like movie star like you yeah either come out with like consistent stuff or like come out with like a few big Bands. things yeah so for me i would probably say i feel like a singer would be fun honestly i would be a singer next one what's your biggest secret if i told you it wouldn't be a secret that's exactly what i was gonna say too that's uh-huh. exactly what i was gonna say so She's a secret. This is like, the first video we can't be exposing. We can't be exposing video. ourselves like Love that. Love the question though. Love the boldness yeah, of the question. Yeah. Love it. Um, what's your biggest regret? Ooh, spice. Wow, I was gonna say dating everyone I dated, but then I would probably be like, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like you have to go through experiences to make yourself a better person. So true, like, honestly. You know what I mean? So like, yeah, like literally. Like, yeah, it sucked, but like I wouldn't. But you learned this, this, so this much. If I didn't. Yeah, learn so much about yeah. yourself, about like other people. Also, my next one is cutting my hair before my freshman year of high school. I hated the haircut, and I think I cried when I got it. <laughs> oh, and ever having bangs. What's my biggest regret? I don't know. Who does? <laughs> Fuck, I don't know. Um, honestly, I would say probably like not being so by the book in high school like i wish i was like more rebellious and like more adventurous and stuff in high school like i was like True. i can't miss class i can't do this i can't you know yeah, me too. like i was very like a straight a student like, I, I could need to, never like, call in sick yeah yeah yes mm-hmm. i feel like i would like if i could like go back you know like that's probably my biggest regret oh that's our last question i'm a, kind of upset with us though because like we're way funnier than this it's in person early. it's it's early. <laughs> My arm hurts from holding this damn camera. But that's okay. I feel like it's like a good starter video. Yeah, you can't like, be too funny. I'm gonna try and like actually upload videos now. Anyway. Thank you guys so much. Like and subscribe. Leave a comment if you Give will. Give it a thumbs up. That helps the channel. Yeah, absolutely. Give me some ideas in the comments for like videos that you guys want to see, like some story times. I have lots of story times if like we want to see that. We kind of have like a whole list actually like already put together for like what we can do for this channel but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and see you next time